Good morning. This is Linda, obviously, fresh back from my vacation. We had problems this morning with the conference call service, and I know we were all looking forward to catching up. And because Mother Mary has been talking to me so much about the tsunami of love and the updates and where are we, I decided to use this format uh, in order to communicate with you and to get the word out. So although I've even been seeing some interference on the screen, some purple lines, I'm going to go ahead and record this regardless because you will receive the energy and the love and the messages from our Divine Mother. So I know we don't have much of an update, but I do want you to have this channeling. So give me a moment and close your eyes and feel yourself simply wrapped in that blue velvet cloak, the cloak of the Divine Mother, as she nurtures you and holds you, cherishes you and loves you. Feel the tri-flame that burns brightly in your heart with a blue diamond the pink diamond of your sweet self, the gold topaz citrine diamond, the canary diamond of Father God. And feel it burn brightly and evenly. One of the things that I've been noticing lately is that not everybody is anchoring. And so as we begin our work together today, make sure that you also from your heart and from your root, send out the connections, the cords, that beautiful silver and red cords down to Gaia, down through the floor, the loose earth, the rock, the granite, the stone, the gaseous layers, down through the water if you're in Florida, down to the heart of Mother Gaia, and feel yourself firmly anchored there as well. So we are connected above in the 13th octave. And below in the heart of Gaia. And make sure you're doing this every day. The changes that we're going through, the expansion, but also the wonderful explanations, the understandings, the wisdom, not just the information, but the wisdom that's coming through right now is so enormous. And yet in many ways so simple that it's important that we be fully in our bodies and grounded and fully expanded interdimensionally aware so that everything is happening simultaneously. And we'll talk about that some more on our next conference call, which is the third Saturday in July at 11 a.m. Eastern Time. Greetings, I am Mary. I am Mary, Universal Mother, Mother of Grace, Mother of All. Mother of each of you, beloved ones. And yes, I come this day to speak to your hearts, to your souls, to your very core, to your being about my tsunami of love. I am the tsunami and you are the tsunami. 
I am the ocean and the air. And you are the ocean and the air. I am the sun and the moon. And you are the sun and the moon. I am the mountains, the streams, the rivers. And so are you. Do you understand, beloved ones, what I say to thee this day? We are one. Do you accept me? Claim me as your mother. Do you love me as I love you, as my child, as your mother? Will you allow yourself to fully receive all the gifts that I bring you and give you this day and every day? For you are precious to me. You always have been. You always will be. Now let us speak of my tsunami of love that grows and penetrates the very core of your planet and of each of you. As I penetrate you, some of you have said to me or said to this channel, I do not feel a thing. What is wrong? Nothing is wrong. Nothing is amiss. Nothing is missing. And you are not missing. You are not exempt. There is no creature, great or small, and certainly not human or hybrid, that is exempt from this wash of my love. Many of you are feeling in greater turmoil than you ever have before. And you say, what is going on? Mother, I am doing my work. I am opening my heart. And yet I feel the anxiety, the shifts, the change. I do not know where solid ground is. Beloved one, you do not know where solid ground is because your feet are in the water. Your feet are in the tsunami. And I am washing you. I am cleansing you. And I am recovering, reestablishing, reconstructing the truth and the totality, the wholeness of who you are. I do not do this to you. I do it for you and with you. And I do it only in love. Have you ever noticed, dear hearts, how there are young babies or even small children who cry and scream and throw tantrums when it is bath time? And yet as soon as they are in the water, they are happy and content and you can't get them out. So it is with some of humanity. And might I say about humanity that in many, many cases we are needing to change the bathwater. Yes, even though it is a tsunami, many, many times. Man's inhumanity to man, the cruelty, the meanness, 
the control, the greed, the lust, the fear is all coming to the surface. And it has to, that it may be washed away with the tides, with the wind, with the currents that surround you. If that energy, which is of human creation, stays within you, it eats you from the inside out. It destroys you and it destroys all civilization. And that, beloved ones, is not and will not be my plan. It is not your plan, it is not my plan, and it is not the unfoldment I refer to. You, each of you, is magnificent beyond your wildest imagination. You get a glimmer now and then, but you have not seen as yet the full wonder of your interdimensional ascended self, the restoration of who you really are. I know you. And dear hearts, I beckon you and I do not beckon you casually or hopefully. I beckon you to join me as I come to you right now. Too many of you are living in the past. What does the past serve you? It is that illusion of time and it plays no purpose other than to show you or to highlight where things went wrong, or to give you fond memories, you can carry those into the now with you. That knowing, that intelligence, that heart. But do not allow it to stop this forward thrust. We are on our pathway. You and I and this planet called Gaia if you must live anywhere, if you cannot find it within your sacred self to live in the now, then go to the future. I will meet you there and I will bring you home. And home is in the present. It is in your heart and it is with me. The tsunami grows. Many of you are feeling the currents rather than the wave. That is all right. Do not worry. Wade in. It is changing humanity. Do not look to the chaos. It cannot create anything. It is human lower dimensional energy and it is not of love. So acknowledge it, be the observer, bless it and send it on its way. And then turn around, extend yourself and let me flow through you. Let me penetrate you. Let me join with you again and again and again until you know what I have always known, that we are one. Go with my love. Sweet angels, go in peace. Come with me. Come with me now, for there is a new world, Nova Earth, Terra Gaia, to be constructed, enjoyed, and celebrated. Farewell.